holiday weekend hangout under the I-10 bridge quickly turned to terror when three teenage girls drove right into the Pascagoula River. They drove straight under the water, like only a little bit of the car was still above the water. 16-year-old Corian Evans from Pascagoula tossed his shoes, shirt, phone, and jumped in. I was just like, I can't let none of these folks down. They need to get out the water. So I just started getting you know, I wouldn't even think about nothing else. Evans, a Pascagoula High student, says he's been swimming since he was about three. He was at the right place at the right time with the right skills. And I started helping both of them trying to stay above from the back. Like they were out behind them trying to keep them above water and swim with them at the same time. I'm glad nothing happened to him while he was trying to save other people's lives. I was really proud of Corian because he wasn't just thinking about himself. He was trying to really get all those people out the water. Marquita Evans now praising her son for helping rescue the three girls, along with Moss Point police officer Gary Mercer. I turn around, I see the police officer, he drowning. He going underwater drowning, saying help. So I went over there. I went and got the, I grabbed the police officer and I'm like swimming him back until I feel myself I can walk. Chief Brandon Ashley releasing this statement to WLOX saying in part, quote, we commend Evans's bravery. If he had not assisted, it could have turned tragic. They was out there throwing up because a lot of water had got inside all of them. One victim, Cora Watson, posting on social media, he saved my life right before my last breath. 25 yards up. So we, it was a lot of swimming. My legs were so tired after. Anything could have been in that water though, but I wouldn't think about it. In Pascagoula, Amber Spradley, WLOX News Now.